Hello everyone, welcome to another Roblox game development tutorial. Today we're going to work with text buttons. We're probably not going to get far enough to script them, but we're going to get far enough to learn how to design them. Now, the thing about GUIs is they're all very much alike. Uh, or the GUI components, sorry. They're all very much alike. So, you're not going to learn too much about text buttons today much because they're much alike text labels so I'm apologizing for that however there's a little little bit of something that's sort of different the main difference is what you can script them to do and we will get to the scripting portion of this tutorial in the next video so let's get started here we're going to get rid of this big image label even actually no I like that image label too much we're going to go to frame uh, we're going to go over here and we're going to find text button it's right here now in text button ah, never remembers the select inserted object text button we'll go down here and you see auto button color that's a new one Basically, what that means is when people hover over it, it's automatically going to change the color of your GUI component. The next part that's a little different, well, to show you this, actually, I'm going to have to make this at least somewhat visible. So I'll just go point one by point one for now. Here's the button. The next part is the style. You can actually use Roblox button, which has this red border, and then this black part, or this Roblox button default, which, okay, I apologize, incorrect information. This Roblox button does not have a red border, that's just the background. This is a gray border, very small, and you might not even be able to see it, but there's a gray border here and then this black inside. And Roblox button default does have a very small red border, but you can't see it right now because it is up against this red background. So that's two things. I'm going to switch it back to Roblox button because I want to. So like I said, there isn't much that changes, except we'll keep auto button color on. Hit F6, and that should start a test, but it didn't. C play solo is F6, so that should have worked. I don't know. It's still in beta, and maybe my screen recorder is messing it up. It's been known to mess up hotkeys before. So we're here, and now if I go over here and I hover over, as you can see, it recolors itself when I hover over it, even though we have not scripted it to do that. However, if I go to players, player one, player GUI, GUI, frame, text button, and change auto button color, you'll see that it doesn't do anything when I hover over it. So that's auto button color. Other than that, text buttons are exactly the same as text labels as far as I know. I've never really run into too many differences. And so just play around with the new two new things and you can start to design a GUI. Next tutorial, we'll actually get started on scripting it. So, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and please enjoy the rest of your Monday.